Hey guys, in this video we're going to chat about how to increase content, how to leverage content discovery with your social media, right? Because sometimes when people think about social media, they think about like posting something and then having your friends share it and that sort of pattern. But you know, how often do your friends really share it, right? It's difficult, right? So one of the really great social media strategies is that, you know, and it's kind of a maybe an immediate or slightly advanced strategy is, okay, Let's say what happens, you know, you, you post something on Facebook, you post something on, th on Twitter, a couple of people click on your things and nobody shares and that's it, what do you do next, right? What do you do next? And th that question arises, be arises because your discovery mechanism is gone, right? Like you, you thought your discovery mechanism was the social sharing. People will share it on Twitter, Facebook, people will like it, but they're not doing that or they're doing that at a very limited rate. Not nearly, not nearly enough for what you need. So the next question, of course, is, okay, what's the next step in discovery? So the great thing you can do is to think about and leverage search-based discoverability, right? So I know there's social sharing discoverability, but now we're going to talk about search-based discoverability. And if you think about it, think about the platforms, like social platforms. My favorite is YouTube, and that's always the one I give an example with, but there are many others, where a lot of discovery on, on YouTube happens through search. I mean, YouTube is a social media site, but the discovery happens through search, right? People search for videos, people search for different things, and then the search engine learns what you like, they start recommending you things. It's, all, it's very much search-based. And so um, what happens there is that you don't need people, you don't need followers to share your stuff. Of course, once you start having subscribers and people who regularly watch your videos, it helps a lot. But it's not necessary to get started because the thing that really helps you on that platform is that there is inherent search and you can really you know get discovered have your videos discovered if you leverage you know if you do like YouTube SEO I know there, I know people mostly think about Google SEO but there's YouTube SEO there's you know App Store SEO there's SEO everywhere where there is a lot of discovery happening with search right because YouTube itself is a gigantic ecosystem and if you, if you leverage search right you, you can get a lot of traffic um, also, don't forget that Google that Google search also likes to put at least one or two YouTube videos in the results, so you can become one of the YouTube videos. So there's a lot of also flexibility once you start leveraging search and different search platforms because sometimes they sometimes those sites they have a lot of traffic within themselves, but sometimes they actually also rank in Google. So you get this amplified discoverability. And so um, it's really something to really think about and consider when you have when you're creating your own social media strategy, is that okay? We have social media, but how can we? What is the intersection between social media and search-based platforms like mobile app stores, um, podcasting, and and iTunes? Right? That has this. So if you ever think if you ever think about having a podcast, iTunes, right? That's, that's discover, there's discoverability there's discoverability there through search um, you know sites like Quora um, very many different sites they have search based discovery right so the intersection of those the high volume for in, in, in the high volume kind of social platform where discovery also happens through search it also can happen through social sharing all of these things have social sharing but there's also search and the search is your great savior kind of sometimes because if you can't get the social sharing started immediately the other option you have is search and if you get them both right it can amplify your presence on that social platform so for my uh, personal preference I mean I wrote an entire book almost purely really centered around how to leverage this nuance and most people they don't quite get this nuance and how powerful it can really be but if you think about it you know all these other like all these other platforms Search on them is not is competitive, but not nearly as competitive as Google search. So you're taking the best of both worlds. It's a high volume platform with a search that's not as competitive as Google search. So you got a good thing going there, and then at the same time, you know you got the whole social thing going there. And these things can really amplify each other. So think in those terms if you can, if it if that sort of logic or thought pattern or or marketing pattern lends itself well to whatever you're doing. Always keep in mind, how do I, you know, because search is not just Google search. Search is on all those platforms. They have search built in and they are large, large search platforms in themselves. So they can really drive a lot of traffic to you if you leverage them right.
So if that was helpful, um, I created many, many, many resources for you to, to, to um, get help. I created some of the top business apps to um, help you plan and start your business. They cover business ideas, business planning, marketing, and fundraising, and they're available on problemio.com, and I'll have the link to that in the description of this video and at the end of the video. Um, and also I wrote two books. One is on going from business ideas to starting a business, and the other book is how to get you massive exposure, uh, how to make you a great marketer. Um, and get you a massive exposure for your business to get you a lot of customers. Um, and those two books, I, I was able to really write a lot uh, and give a lot of advice in them that I wasn't able to. Sometimes the videos are short and the apps, they don't, they're condensed, but the, but the, the books are they're, they're long longer, so I was able to really say a lot that I wanted to say. So try the books, try the apps, they're all available on problemion.com. And of course, uh, subscribe to this channel. And definitely comment on the videos because you know you don't have to just watch. You can also participate, and we can you can we can continue the conversation um, together. Right in the comments, I see all the comments that, you, that people make, and I, I I I try my best to respond to all of them. So I'll see your comment, I'll respond, and we'll, we'll continue talking. Um, so keep in touch and um, subscribe, and yeah, I look forward to hearing from you. Bye.